Hey everyone, hope you're doing okay. I wanted to real quick show you how you can tell the difference between um, an insect issue in your lawn and a watering issue, which is real important to know right now because uh, the summer months and into the fall, uh, that's the, the, uh, the time where we have the most insect damage in our lawns because we're dealing with chinch bugs, we're dealing with grub worms, we're dealing with army worms. And it's also the time where we have the most watering issues because it's the hottest, uh, driest time of the, of the year. And so it's important to know the, the difference between the two to be able to tell the difference between the two because um, you know, obviously you deal with them di uh, much differently. So this is the perfect example right here behind me. I can, uh, you, you can see right here that this area right here is kind of brown. It's a little bit off. For over here we have a lot of green grass. Um, back in that area over there is green. But right here in the middle section, uh, this is really starting to brown. I can tell right off the bat that this is very likely a watering issue. And the reason is is because it's so widespread it's such a big area, um, it's all browning evenly, it's browning at the same time and at the same rate. And that's an indication that it's a watering issue. That's an indication that there's a sprinkler head that's not working, that uh, there's a zone that's not working, uh, something, something's uh, keeping this area from getting enough water. Um, if this was a, a, uh, a insect problem, it, it, it would be much more random, uh, it would be much more uh, uh, patchy and sporadic. And that's what insect issues uh, look like. They don't start out looking like this, widespread and, and, and even at the same rate. So that's really how you can tell the difference. Um, now insect issues can look like that eventually if it takes over and kills your entire lawn. But here in the early stages as you're trying to diagnose issues in your lawn, that's the best way to tell. If it's widespread and even, that's a watering issue. If it's starting to pop up here and there a little bit uh, uh, sporadic and patchy and random, that's going to be an insect issue. So hope that helps. So let us know if you have any questions. Thanks.